to keep you updated, Listín Diario, the newspaper for the Dominicans, presents the most important news of the day. Saturday, April 13th of 2024. A decree published in the official newspaper, Le Moniteur, announced the formation of the long-awaited Transitional Presidential Council of Haiti in charge of filling an institutional vacuum and restoring order in the Caribbean country, shaken for weeks by an explosion of violence. The General Commander of the Army of the Dominican Republic, Major General Carlos Antonio Fernandez Onofre, assured that the border is safe and quiet after taking a tour in the company of senior officers through the Independencia and Pedernales provinces. The public minister reported that a team of prosecutors is working to respond as soon as possible to the complaint that a Haitian teenager was sexually raped during an operation led by prosecutor Claudia Lorena Garrido in Verón, La Altagracia province. The Dominican Association of Teacher, ADP, and the Ministry of Education are leading a public discussion about the allocation of a 20% salary increase promised last year for practicing teachers. The Higher Electoral Tribunal issued a ruling by which it excluded candidates Rafael Paz, Celines Mende, Rosa Feliciano, and Katiuska Morel from the People's Force ballot, in addition to ordering the political organization to reconfigure its electoral ballot in the number one constituency of the National District at the level of deputations. For this and more information, you can visit listindiaria.com. For Listing Diario voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez. To keep you updated, Listing Diario, the newspaper for the Dominicans, presented the most important news of the day.